We're about to get started with our mark.com project. So here we go. Um, you're watching this video right now and you're gonna open up a new tab and go to mark.com. And once you get there, if you're not already logged in, click log in. And of course, we always log in with our Google account whenever possible. So click on that. And you can close the other Mark tab if you have an extra one like I do. And you'll end up on this screen. And from here, um, just double check and make sure that you don't have more than um, two projects. So if you click on My Projects, you'll see if you, have, um, if you already have more than two, it's not going to let you create a new one. If you only have two like I do, or if you only have one, um, that's fine too, but it won't let you have more than two projects. So you can either click this button or this button, and it's going to do the same thing. And we're going to choose blank project. Again, blank project. And then read the quote. And you'll end up in the editor. Uh, the name of our project, very important that you name it right away. Your last name, underscore I am. And then press enter. And then from here, um, you're ready to begin. The only other thing that you might want to change is your orientation, which you can do right over here on the project pane. Um, so right now, it's a standard 8.5 by 11 sheet of paper. But if you click this button, it's going to switch it to landscape. It's still the same dimensions. It's just flipped on its side. And as you can see from the examples on the wall, um, either one is fine. So it's really up to how you want to create your work. Um, the portrait version is usually for printed work, and the landscape version is often for um, video uh, or for something that you might find on the web, but it really is up to you. Let me know if you have any questions, and remember to follow the instructions here and also use the rubric as you're creating your work. You won't be able to submit this until the second day that we work on it, um, so we're in no rush. Please don't ask to submit it on the first day. There's a reason why. I don't want you to submit stuff the first day we start it. We've had that this, the whole year. Um, but again, read the instructions, look at the examples, look at the rubric, and let me know if you have any questions.